Anderson Cancer Center has developed a curriculum to teach children about sun safety and to help teachers communicate the importance of sun safety to parents. Hi, my name is Lucy. In this curriculum, children meet superhero characters who travel around the world using their superpowers of sun protection. You can learn more about the characters and their superpowers in the curriculum and your teacher's guide. Let's watch how preschool center directors and teachers are using this curriculum to help children develop sun safety habits. Are you sun safe? Are you sun safe? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. I'm wearing sunscreen. I'm wearing sunscreen. Yay for me. Serena says, put on your hat. Our hat protects our head from the sun. Yeah. Serena says, put on your sunscreen so we can protect our face and our neck and our arms and our legs. Serena says, put on your sunglasses. Our sunglasses protect, what do they protect? Our eyes, our eyes from the sun. Serena says, show me how you put on a long sleeve shirt to protect our arms. Yes, Mila, protect our arms. We have to protect our arms. Serena says, put on your pants. Show me how you put on your pants. They protect our legs, right? Good job. Serena says, pretend we're under the shade. When there's too much sun, we go under the shade, right? To protect our bodies from the sun. Good job. Oh, look at those shadows. See how large your shadows are this time of the morning? This is the best time of the day to be out. Notice the height of the shadows, see? Let me see. Let me see a statue. Make a statue. How about I try The shadow rule was really great. It really taught us that when you go out in the morning time, your shadow is taller, and that would be a safer time to go out and play because the sun's rays are not that harmful to our skin versus when you go out in the um, mid-afternoon, uh, your shadow is shorter and the sun rays are more harmful to our skin. Okay, guys, wow, look at the difference in our shadows from this morning. See how much smaller they are? When we came out this morning, our shadows was full and long. Compared to this morning until now, coming out at around noon, look at the difference in the shadows. That means that the sun rays are now more harmful than this morning. So we have to be cautious about coming out at this time of the day and to make sure that we're protected and keeping it safe. I spy a sun safe superpower that protects your head. What protects your head that's here? Where is it? A hat. A hat. That protects our head, right? Yeah. Good job. I spy a sun safe superpower that protects your eyes. What is it? The sunglasses. The sunglasses. The sunglasses. Yeah, good job. I spy a sun safe superpower that protects our legs. What do we put on that protects our legs? Is it? All right. Get back, get back, get back. It's the sunscreen and the pants, right? We put them on to protect our legs, right? I spy a sun safe superpower. Yeah, listen, that we put on and it protects our arms. What is it? Shirt. A long sleeve shirt, right? Kind of like mine or Layla's or Mila's, right? Now, I spy a sun safe superpower that we use to put on our face and our arms and our legs to protect us from the sun. What is it? The sunscreen. Yeah, good job. Remember when the sun comes out? 
and it makes shaded areas, right? Okay, now we are going to do our shade game. All right, go find shade. Find shaded areas. I found shade. Did everybody find shade? They really enjoyed going from shaded area to shaded area, and they were really proud of themselves. And now when we go outside to play, they tend to look for the shaded areas to play in. Great job for finding shade. So let's see what happened to the sunscreen when it goes in the water. Do you see the water? The water is very, very clear. Watch. You can see where the water is getting cloudy. And when you get in the pool, when you get in the pool, you will see the sunscreen come off the body into the water. It's getting cloudy. Yes, it is cloudy. We sweat and we swim, it comes off. If you take a nap and you go back outside to play, what you need to do with your sunscreen? Reapply it. So you have to tell your parents you need to have sunscreen so you can reapply it on your skin so you can do what to your skin? So it doesn't get sunburned. So you won't get sunburned, that's right. What are these? Okay, Alana, I want you to hold them up and I want you to walk like this. When we get outside, you hold it up high so people know that you wear your shades to be sun safe. I'm gonna put them on my eyes. Okay, and what is this? A hat. A hat, and it protects our head. Here, Jackson, when we get outside, I want you to raise it up so people can see it. Oh, what's this? Umbrella. It makes our own shade. Miles, you can take the umbrella. And what is this? A shirt. A shirt. And why? Is this a sun safe shirt? Yes. All right. This says, I love sun. I am sun safe. Yes, I am. Sun safe. Yes, I am. What I really liked most about the activities throughout the curriculum were that they were so easy to follow. Sometimes we have activities that are meant for older kids and we have a hard time bringing it down to a toddler level. But with this, it was just so easy to make it so that even the younger kids could have fun as well as the older kids. MD Anderson's Sun Safety Curriculum can be incorporated into your schedule at different times of the day, such as circle time, small group time, outdoor play, center time, and story time. Sing the songs during transition time. Connect with parents during arrival and pickup times. Refer to your teacher's guide and curriculum for activities, parent connections, and more. Remember to be a role model, be creative, and make it fun.